Hi all, welcome to my second video on my Asus M50. On the last video I only made a 4 minute video based on the exterior of the computer and stylings and stuff like that. And I didn't want too many, well, I, don't, I didn't want a very long video and bored everybody. But as requested, um, I have to, well I don't have to, but I choose to make another video on the computer usage and the boot up of it. I'm just going to start by this. Last time, last time I said that this is the M50 SA model but a lot of people told me that they're going to buy the VM model which is very different. The first of all is the SA doesn't have the express gate so that's something and the VM does. The other thing is I am using Centrino 1 while the, the VM will use Centrino 2 and there will be a lot of spec difference and I'll put that in the description. So now it's boot up but it's only taken only half a minute. In case you haven't tried, well haven't seen or tried anything like a fingerprint I'm just going to demonstrate. I hope this will work for the first time. Doesn't work. Oh, for goodness sake. Well it's always like that. and it will just recognize it straight away and um, it takes quite a long time to well take care of it anyway so that's the difference of the computer <coughs> one thing worth mentioning is about this computer is this media control on the touchpad because when you tap this mode button it will light up and you can use it as a media control and you don't have to worry about uh, using as a mouse anymore and if you have plugged an external mouse and this one is included with a computer and you can just use the computer and then you don't have to touch hot keys and you can just scroll with uh, the mute and the, and the volume bar which is really cool for, for this computer and the reason why I didn't buy the VM model is because it's that model is actually more expensive and in thinking of buying other accessories for the computer it might be over budget for me so I had to buy this and this is just fine for me anyway but the graphics card I'm using ATI now but the VM model will get the 9600 series GS which will be awesome now some people told me that uh, they worried about 4 gigabyte won't be recognized but I'm just going to uh, do properties and have a look. I'm not sure you're going to see this, but it says 4 gigabyte. It is saying 4 gigabyte, and uh, which it doesn't matter anyway. So that's it, really. Thank you very much.